Well, um, you all saw the score. You all know what happened. Um, a rare thing happened today, folks. Clemson lost two straight games. I got a lot of things I want to say. Um, I suffered a lot. You know, trolls were coming in here, you know, talking about how Clemson's going to go like 7-5. and five. That's not going to happen. We play in the ACC. It's Bush League in there. Um, look, first of all, I'm going to get into the nice part of the video, which is going to be about two or three minutes. Then I'm going to get into a part where I, I really don't want to yell because I've been yelling all night. I might just... Okay, first of all, congratulations to Georgia. You know, Georgia fans, I don't like at all. I think they're really obnoxious with the... <laughs> and, um... Pretty much a bunch of rednecks. But, um... You know, there are some... I mean, there are 75% bad apples and a 25% miracle of good apples in that fan base. All right, talk about um, Georgia's defense. Golly, they were they were amazing. Um, they played really good. They played really well. They played really well. You know, they gave up a few passes. Um, Joseph Ngata played really well tonight for Clemson's wide receiver number ten. Justin Ross didn't play. I thought Ross was gonna be better. He had like what did he have like four catches, twenty five yards. He wasn't great. Um, George defense, I think you might have 11 NFL starters. It should be illegal to have that good of a defense. That's the best defense I've seen us play um, in a long fucking time. Or DJ's just not as... Let's talk about DJ. Let's talk about DJ. DJ is not Trevor Lawrence. He's not Deshaun Watson. All right? He's not better than this quarterback right now. Now, it's tough to go out here in week one and just play like that. Um... But um, he just didn't look – he didn't look great. But, again, he didn't look horrible. I mean, I, I know a lot of people are going to overestimate. You know, I mean, the, Georgia's defense is the best in football right now. It is, all right? So, anyway, back to Georgia. I think Georgia is the best team in college football, even over Alabama today. Anyone can beat Miami. We see this time and time again. Just, I'll give you a quick recap on what I thought about that game. Uh, Miami is, this is the same, this is the same book for Miami. This is the same stuff. We see this every single time Miami takes on a ranked opponent in top 10. They fold like that. North Carolina, Clemson, uh, multiple times Clemson, and, uh, now Alabama. And whoever they play next, just, uh, Miami's at 8-14. Um, first of all, I don't, before, I don't want to see people say, well, if we can win out, anyway, congratulations, Georgia. Okay, now let me get to more of the Clemson part. If we can win out, we go win 12 straight, we can make the playoffs. Look, we got a long season. We just we just played our first game. There's a lot of things. Clemson, you, you guys, Clemson is, I mean, you saw a lot of teams didn't look great. Iowa State didn't look, they look terrible. Oklahoma, I mean, we saw a lot of good teams. I mean, only of course, only Alabama and Georgia would come out and uh, play dominant like that. So we got a tough one next week, South Carolina State. We, um, so should we should probably lose. I'm okay, um, but no, we should we should hopefully get better and better as the season goes along. Um, and anything of end of Clemson Dynasty is just gonna shut that down. That's retarded. Um, gonna shut anything down of Clemson losing four games. That's also retarded. Uh, shutting those things down. Okay, offensive line. Offensive line was horrible last year against Ohio State. They were, they were awful. It was the same thing. Like, it was the same thing. I mean, I, I yelled at them. They were piss poor. They were horrible. They, they were really, really, really bad. And the worst part was when we had an interception down 7 nothing, or or when we were, had a, when the, the Georgia player football scraped off his uh, left uh, calf or right calf, whatever the fuck it was. I don't remember. I'm, I'm, yeah, whatever. We hit the ball at the 50 multiple times, and then it would always end up with DJ getting sacked. Offensive line got absolutely dominated from the line of scrimmage. It got absolutely dominated from the line of scrimmage. Um, they were horrible. Uh, uh, if you Now, if we play UGA again, I don't think we're going to win. I mean, I just don't want uh, I don't think this team's gonna win the national championship. All right, I, I'm, you know, 
this, this okay. The defense is elite. Okay, it's really good, but the offense is very inexperienced on quarterback. DJ, as great as DJ was last year, he only played two games. Like, he only played two games. And Georgia's defense is no joke. I mean, they're no joke. I mean, we weren't going to come on here and drop 40 like, like we do in Notre Dame. I think we put up 40 and lost 47 to 40. That wasn't going to happen. That just wasn't going to happen. Georgia's that damn good. So, I think the goal uh, for Clemson is just, even though this hurts, you just have to root for Georgia. You just have, you have to hope Georgia number one. I think you got to hope Georgia goes 13-0. I really think you have to. Um, but anyway, let's talk about uh, what I should I mention. Okay, quarterback, running back, wide receiver. Wide receivers are hard today. Um, oh, Brandon Galloway, fuck you. He costed us the game on that damn drop. We could have tied the game there. Um, we would have had the ball inside the 40. Fuck you, dude. I'm pissed off about that. That 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 was a play. Oh, referees, again, a little iffy, but how in the hell did they miss that call? Um, our guy was three, three, four yards out of bounds, and he hits him. I mean, how did you miss that call? Dabo has a reason to cry on that, okay? Dabo, was, Dabo can cry, okay? He has a reason crying on that. He has a reason. Like, is that not a valid reason? Like, take your team. I mean, your coach will be crying too, man. Three, four yards out of bounds. But that's not the reason we lost. Um, just, I love my excuses. Yeah, I love them. Um, what else should we talk about? What else should we talk about? Uh, where are Clemson going to drop? I would say six. Um, I think... Um, I think Georgia should be one, Bama should be two, or they'll flip those. It doesn't really matter. I think Ohio State's going to be three, Oklahoma's going to be four. Even though they look absolutely dick shit today, Iowa State will be five. I think Clemson should be six. Uh, I would be shocked if Clemson was down at like 11. I, I, mean, I mean, we lost by seven points. I mean, I don't think it was that bad. I mean, Georgia's a fucking good team. Um, I mean, that's why I didn't really talk that much trash this offseason. Because uh, Georgia's a good team. They've been a good team. They're a great program. They just can't finish the job. Um, they're so fucking talented, it's unbelievable. They're way more, their, talent, their talent level is more talented than Clemson. It is. Um, defensive line, sort of ishy. Sort of ishy. Um, it was all right. But our, our offensive line had three seconds. Their offensive line was better than ours. They, they, are, their offensive, they dominated line of scrimmage, uh, whatever way you want to cook, look at it. Um, linebackers were solid. Corners. I mean, Georgia just played a great game. They just had some penalties. They were definitely pass interfering. Uh, interfering. With that one play, they threw them down. Um, we, uh, the touch, we couldn't get in the end zone tonight. I mean, this this did anyone get vibes of the Sherbo versus Alabama when we couldn't score? Like we lost, like what did we lose twenty four to six. I mean, we didn't give up twenty four, but but I, I tell you what, Georgia's offense is not bad. I mean, J T. Daniels didn't play well tonight. I, I, I personally, I don't think he played well. He he also threw an interception. He just didn't throw a pick six. Um, he also threw an interception, um, and I don't even think he threw as mu uh, much or more yards. Indeed. He just had a better offensive line. I tell you what, I'll take D J over J T. I don't care what anyone says. I'm taking D J over J T. Still. I really am. Yeah, you can cry about it in the comment section. DJ threw a pick six. JT threw an interception, okay? And he had less yards. I'm still taking DJ over JT right now. You know, DJ haters are, you know, out the window. But, look, JT um, didn't play well either. I mean, they I mean, they both played great defenses. Okay. I've said all I want. Will Shipley. I mean, our running back is we missed Travis Etienne and Trevor Lawrence so bad. I think I didn't appreciate Trevor Lawrence enough, you know. Just appreciate, you know, UNC fans appreciate Spam Sam out. I, I mean, I don't. I, I think you need to appreciate him with more and more than uh, you can imagine. Um, but anyway, I'm gonna go. Tough loss, you know. This is gonna get a lot of views, I'm sure, because Clemson loses. It's late. I'm tired. I will, if we would have won, I made this in the morning. But I'm going to go eat and go sleep and upload this video. Congratulations, Georgia fans. You guys got us this time. Hopefully, we can uh, see you again soon. Go Tigers from Clemson's family.